there are plenty of students in our building who may not have been in certainly many parts of the United States, let alone in other countries. And here come five, six, seven foreign exchange students from various parts of the world. These students bring a wealth of experience. They share their culture with us. At the same time, they get to be a part of what we hope our culture is like at the high school. Having a person like Hiba who's Muslim come to our school is absolutely a, a gigantic benefit because if there are those stereotypes, having someone like Hiba who said, nope, this is my faith, this is what I'm about, but here's all of these other characteristics about me, it wasn't like, oh, there's the foreign exchange student. Nope, there's Hiba and she's off to cheerleading practice or she's off to class, you know, or, or she's dancing at, at prom. She's just a part of our DCG family. So I had Heba in my Spanish well, one class, and my first impression was, here's a girl who wants to be here and who wants to learn. We do a cultural club, and we went to the Hindu temple that's near here. It was such a neat experience for the other students to also watch uh, Heba because she also speaks Hindi in, in addition to four other languages. And so for the students to see her interacting with the Hindu priest and asking questions in Hindi, it, it starts to get the students to think about, huh, maybe I need to pay more attention to another language. I met Heba in marching band. She sat at my lunch table and people were always super, super curious. And she was always so willing to tell her story and tell people everything that they wanted to know. Just being able to have her in my life for that short amount of time makes a difference because you get to learn about so much culture and so much about her personal life. And you know, if I want to go to Morocco, I can just talk to Hiba and be like, hey, what are you doing? <laughs> Hiba was our third student that we had. We knew she was coming from Morocco. We didn't know anything about Morocco. I'm not really that great with geography at all, so. <laughs> And having exchange students has impacted our daughter by giving her a reality check. I mean, our, our kids in the U.S. don't realize the differences. And now once she's had these girls in our home, she sees and hears and learns from them. Hello. Hello. Can you see How us? How are you guys doing? We're good. good. How are you? I always am a big advocate of this of hosting. I think anybody that has a heart for kids, I think it's a great option to do and a great experience. Students like Heba are showing our kids what it takes to have a little bit of grit, the courage, the guts, the fortitude to leave your family in the comfort of your country, to come to the United States, to smaller town Iowa, to be a part of a, a year of high school, the YES program has just been a thrill for me to work with in my last four years. I certainly hope, as long as they'll let me be the principal here, that that relationship continues for many, many years. Mm -hmm.